Hi everybody, it's Betty here with your Arizona Commission for the Deaf and Hard of Hearing Video Legislative Update. We're about halfway through the legislative session and it means that a lot has gotten done, but yet not enough. But I can tell you, we've been pretty busy. Both of our bills, Senate Bill 1055 and Senate Bill 1056, have both passed out of the Senate unanimously. Just a quick reminder, Senate Bill 1055 is the Commission Sunrise Bill. That allows us to continue our duties for another eight years. Senate Bill 1056 allows uh, the Commission to make recommendations to the legislature as it relates to language assessment and literacy readiness. It also includes deafblind in the Commission's duties as a population and community members that we can, we can serve. That bill did pass out of the Senate with a small amendment as it related to the definition of deafblind. We just clarified the definition to more similarly match the Helen Keller Act um, that's in the federal system. So with that said, <clears throat> it's in the House of Representatives, both of those bills, and moving along. So we'll keep you updated on how those bills progress. In addition to our bills, we've been monitoring several other bills uh, that we believe will have an impact on the community members that we serve, uh, such as education bills. There have been a couple of bills as it relates to special education funding that we've been monitoring, as well as other bills pertaining to hearing aid coverage, insurance, the and most and also just as important the outcomes of the governor's task force on vulnerable adult abuse and the ad hoc committee on vulnerable adult abuse which our very own sherry collins was a committee member of that so all of those bills we're monitoring we're having meetings with legislators we're letting them know how the bills uh, will have positive or negative impact on members' lives, and we're gonna keep having those conversations throughout this legislative session. In addition, and mostly, uh, lastly, I should say, is the budget. We expect the budget to be more contentious than we originally thought of. There are some huge discrepancies between uh, the legislator's proposed budget and the governor's proposed budget. So. We expect that there's going to be a lot of dialogue and debate about who and what should get funded and we'll make sure that you are updated and included on what the what the final budget looks like because it does impact you as consumers in the state of Arizona. So keep a lookout, um, keep watching our legislative updates and if you ever need anything, you know we're just a, a text away.